Hi guys, Butch here from Baker Archery Products. Anyway, I was asked to do a three post layout and we'll kind of get to it. I'll move you in a little closer here in a second, but we'll try to probably have to break this down in a couple different videos, but we'll, we'll go from the start here and, and lay it out. Anyway, I'll move you a little closer. You don't have to look at me. How's that? That's a good start. So just this is an example. This is my, uh, I don't know if you can read that, it's being backwards. Anyway, I got this on my tablet. I had to upload the Office 365 on here in order to get the Excel to work. Anyway, just for an example, if I can get it to work. Um, I want a 36 inch string just for do a 37 inch string just for purposes 37 hit return and that populated all of this you got two posts three posts and four post settings so it tells me to measure from the two closest posts the stretcher assembly to this post should be 32 and 9 16 so we'll do that real quick important deal I'm going to tell you these posts are 10 inches wide you can't forget to change this upper part here because that changes the formulas down in here so we'll see how it works out I haven't built a string in a while so we want to go to 32 and 9 sixteenths this is probably a little slower than uh, Post, but when you have lots of, when you got plenty of time and not tons of resources, the unit struts are not all that accurate, so you kind of got to play with it just a little bit, and that's pretty close there. Anyway, I'll, uh, anyway, this is this is my design, this tape measure. Well, the bite of tape measures, but the hook, the hook plate on the end. Install them with uh, electrical tape, but they work good for hooking over deals. And when you get out 80 inches, kind of a pain in the butt when you're trying to hook them on this way, they keep falling off. Anyway, I'm going to just lay out kind of a little gizmo I come up with the other day. This is just a piece of half inch PVC. Anyway, we'll laid out a free post so one thing I gotta sorry to keep jumping around but I have my spring lock in here and I have about a hundred pounds on it so when I'm laying out I'm not collapsing the uh, spring in there right. like I said I haven't done a string in a while As I'm laying it out, I'm holding my thumb on this spool. one more strand just a demo string anyway borrow this technique from my buddy Laurent in uh, France It's just 
just spooling it off just enough to keep it on the post. You want to notice that the strands are not sagging and you don't want to keep reefing on it. It only takes a little bit to un have uneven tension and then your uh, get some serious peep rotation. How many is that? I should have been counting. Anyway, that's enough. And we'll loop it around there and around the tie-off point. I don't know if you can see that. I wrap it around three times and pull it in there and it should stay. There's the layout. I think I'll, uh, I'll do the serving here in a minute and do a swap. We'll just do another video. Stay tuned.